Hi, my name is Eric Willison. I'm an Ohio attorney. I'm going to talk to you today about the CDC order, supposedly, which purports to ban evictions all the way out until October 4th of 2021. If you will recall, the CDC had originally banned evictions and it was supposed to end uh, in December of 2020, then it got extended and extended and extended. Then it went to the United States Supreme Court and Justice Kavanaugh ruled that, well, it's supposed to go to uh, July 31st. We don't think it's constitutional, but we're not gonna mess with it because it's only about 30 days away from ending on its own terms anyway, so whatever. Well then, it ended for about two or three days. Now this is for banning evictions for people who don't pay rent. This doesn't stop you from uh, evicting somebody because they have an unauthorized dog or otherwise breaching the lease. But if it's just for unpaid rent uh, and they're saying that it's COVID, then there's a process where they can go and, the, uh, and stop the eviction from happening via this CDC order. Now, after uh, that CDC order ended on July 31st of 2021, within a few days, it was reinstated. But the wording was a little bit different. <clears throat> and if you live in Ohio, that's going to be important because if you go to page 13 of the CDC order, the first full paragraph says that the new order stopping evictions for unpaid rent through October 4th does not apply in any state wherein a federal court has said that the CDC order is unconstitutional. Well, the Sixth Circuit Court of Appeals, which covers the state of Ohio, did just that in a case called Tiger Lily LLC versus the Department of Housing, Urban and Development. And that was uh, dated, I believe, in July of 2021. So the Sixth Circuit Court of Appeals has ruled that the CDC order is unconstitutional. Therefore, by the CDC order's own terms, this is the new CDC order, it does not apply. So if you are in court and the judge says, sorry, they extended the CDC ban, uh, then you can argue that no judge turn to the 13th page and you'll see that uh, it doesn't apply to Ohio because that's covered by the Sixth Circuit. And the case on that was Tiger Lily LLC versus Department of Housing and Urban Development. So enough ping pong back and forth uh, with regard to whether or not uh, the CDC order is going to apply in Ohio. I take the position that it does not, and most of the courts I'm practicing in take that same position, and quite right too.